Hello everyone. So this video is a little bit different to the videos I'm used to making. As you can see, I'm in the car. I'm with my mum. Say hello. Hi. And uh, we're on our way to the hospital so I can get some constructive uh, surgery. I have, um, I guess what a lot of people would refer to as a deviated septum. Um, and it is... Sorry about that, we got a phone call. Um, so we're on the way to the hospital, and um, yeah, so what people call a deviated septum. Um, so what it means is that I've got, you know, compromised breathing and things like that, and it's just something that is worth getting fixed. So I'm getting it fixed. So you can probably tell from this angle, I don't know, a lot of people say they don't see it until I tell them, but you can tell that the nose is crooked. It just kind of slopes all the way along, kind of comes back in. So if we go to this angle, you can see there's a bump there. And what I like to tell people is that the middle of my nose is actually here, and it should be here. So that's a hard, tough piece there um, because it's just kind of all doing its crumble thing. So I'm gonna go and say it's beyond deviated um, and uh, that's why it's getting fixed. A lot of people ask me if I'm nervous and I mean, I'm the kind of person not to really think about it until it's happening and even now we're on the way there and I'm, I'm not really sure how to feel. I guess I don't know how I'll feel until I'm getting ready to go in. Um, I've never been uh, a patient in a hospital other than my birth. Um, I've never been put under. Um, so this is all going to be a very new experience for me. And I thought I'd share this, ex uh, this experience with all of you. Um, maybe that's my nerves kicking in. I don't know. Um, but I know all will go well. And um, yeah, so hopefully uh, this is of interest to you um, and it'll definitely be interest of me to be able to look back on it. Um, so say goodbye to this face um, because it might change ever so slightly and um, who knows uh, what will be. Oh, who knows, mum over there, gosh, ridiculous. All right, um, I'll catch you later, bye. Hey guys, so this is me post-op and I feel fantastic. <laughs> I can't feel anything when it comes to my face. Like it just feels like I'm really stuffy. Um, I'm here with my mom. And yeah, just super stuffy. Like I don't feel too groggy. And that might just be me. Um, but surgery went well considering. I mean, that's what I've been told. So the thin line to me. I don't think they'd lie. Um, so I guess the healing process goes from here. Uh, and yeah, I don't know what else to say. I feel great. My main concern is I've got an ice pack on my back. And it's super cold. Um, but I think it's necessary. Um, I should be here for a couple more hours. Uh, so how long does surgery go for Ma? Do you know how long? hours I woke up feeling amazing and I know that because I just started talking to the nurses and I think they were like yeah we'll be here and we'll call you mum <laughs> so I think they were happy for me to talk to mum because they felt better things to do uh, but they've been really good and yeah this is the start so I'm really looking forward to what's to come I can't wait my nurse is here so I better go Bye-bye! So this is the post-op. I'm feeling great. I might be the drug speaking. Hey! You know what the best thing about this whole thing is? I just finished Counter Sprite and they gave me an icy pull. Like, I don't want to leave. So my mum is here. Hi mum! And she thinks I'm being a bit ridiculous. I think I'm being normal. I'm just feeling a little bit blocked, which is, you know, expected. 
But uh, I don't know the lead because I get icy balls.